What's going on guys? Today we're here with Joe at the RZ Mass booth. I get a lot of questions asking the difference between the old RZ Mass, the new RZ Mass, and then of course the neoprene RZ Mask. Which one should you buy? And uh, of course, I know, but this video is to help you figure out if you're going to buy one of these or one of these neoprene masks as well. So uh, we got Joe here who's our expert. He's going to go a little bit over why these masks are better and uh, exactly which one is best for you. So Joe, take it over. Yep, absolutely. So this is our first model we came out with. It's called the M1. This outer shell here is neoprene, and we have all sorts of different kind of fun designs, as you can see. Uh, but it's the same concept with all three of our masks. We have three different uh, components. We have a, uh, an outer shell here. This material is washable and reusable. Underneath that, we have a filter. This is what's really uh, you know, in charge of getting all the dust and the particulates out of your lungs. And then we have these exhalation valves. They allow all your exhaled air to escape out of the mask and keeps all the heat and the moisture from building up inside. Uh, so like I said, this is the neoprene. It's great for cold weather use. Also, it has only one strap that goes around the back of your neck. So uh, to take it on and off, you can do it independently from your other head equipment like your a hat or your glasses. You can get it on and off very quickly and easily. So that's the M1. Uh, the M2, exactly the same as the M1, but it uses a mesh material. I don't know if you can, the camera can pick that up, but it's, uh, it's a mesh material, so great for hot weather. Same kind of thing with the single strap, same filter underneath, and uh, it's good for not only dust, but fumes, odors, smoke, organic chemicals. So uh, it's a carbon filter, so not just dust. And then one more that I have here. This is the newest one, it's called the M2.5. It's exactly the same as the M2, but rather than the single strap, you have the dual strap. So this one goes up over the crown of your head, and then this one goes around the back of your neck. Uh, so two straps here. And really, the, the, the dual straps, it's gonna take a little bit you know, longer to get on and get adjusted, just like your traditional paper mask would. You gotta kinda go over the crown of your head, but once it's on, it's very secure with this extra head strap. So if you're gonna be doing something where you're gonna put your mask on and you're gonna leave it on for a long period of time, maybe even break a sweat, I'd recommend the 2.5. But if you're gonna be taking your mask on and off frequently, you know, going with either the, uh, the one or the two yep. is probably going to be ideal for you. So that's uh, that's the main difference between the mask. Uh, now, one question, I'm going to point this out because I get this all the time. Can, I, can we grab that bag? This bag right here? Yes, sir. The first thing I get asked when you get these cool bags is, what is this for? <laughs> that's true. This, yep. is, this is the first question I get asked is, why is this on there? What's it do? Do you, you know, if I bought one or more, does do they connect them together somehow? Guys, this is what you use to take and change the filtration uh, on your mask. So if, if you want to show us that yeah. real quick, that would be great so these people can understand exactly how this works. So these exhalation valves, they actually have a top piece and a bottom piece. The bottom piece here has a little open and closed directional arrow. You can see that. And there's this groove that goes across, and there's a groove that these line up just like that. And then it helps, it just helps you twist it like so. And then this comes out, this comes out. And then you do it to the other side and your filter comes out. Uh, so here, I'll, I'll do it quick for you. So yeah, so that takes the, the filter out and just makes, you don't necessarily need to use it, but uh, it's there just in case, you know, you want to use it. So. so guys, that is the number one, probably the number one question I get asked the most is, what is this little thing on the outside of the back? So now you know what that is actually used for, it's for switching your filters out. And these guys, when it comes to dust, pollen, leaf seasons here, guys, let me tell you something. These are lifesavers during leaf season. And if you make sure you get a good fit, because I hear a lot of people say that they put it on, they have their safety glasses on, and it fogs up their glasses. Yeah. Well, on the nose of these, you can adjust these. Uh, there's a piece of metal on the outside here that you can adjust them tighter to your face. 
and you should not be fogging up your glasses. These should fit, and if you go to their website, it tells you what weight class you're in and what mask they recommend that you get as well. So check them out. It's RZ Mask. Yep, rzmask.com. Keep messing up. Yep, and we're gonna do something special here at the show. We wanna do a little giveaway on the channel here, so all you gotta do, uh, comment below saying which mask would be best for you. You know, either the M1, the M2, the M2.5. Remember, the M1 is for cold weather, M2 for hot weather, the 2.5 is for uh, intensity, high intensity. Uses. So uh, let us know which one you would like, and then we're going to pick three winners and uh, three winners, ship you guys out a mask. Uh, probably, I'm assuming, some sort of time frame after the video goes live. Yep, yep. So, yep. of course, we're at GIE this week. We'll make this video live next week. Uh, it'll probably be Monday. Uh, is what I'm going to guess Monday or Tuesday of this coming week since well, of course I'm out of town all week this week and three winners uh, What is there a time frame on that? What, what do you want to do? You want to do like, uh, let's go till Friday? Yeah, let's go a week after it goes live. Okay, yeah, a, week. a week after it goes live. So you have till Monday and then uh, we're going to get up with RZ here again yep. and uh, talk to Joe and see uh, let them pick the three winners. Uh, yeah. And then of course I will email y'all or I will comment on the comment section below, let you know you won, and then you can send me your information and I can send it over to them. So good luck guys. Thanks for watching. Smash that subscribe button. We'll see you soon. All right.